Hey, welcome back everyone. Hope you're all doing okay and had a good week. Let's get this started. You know, I keep trying to tell people that flares are, they all look alike. <laughs> and yet people don't believe me. I mean, just like it says, this is a flare. When you see those, those are flares. <laughs> All right, starting off. See how this area right up here is pretty well illuminated and the sun's not even up yet. And as the sun begins to come up over here, all of this is gonna get dark. Look how dark it's getting back there. We got light, we got sh shadow. I mean, that's a lot of shadow going on up there. The higher the sun gets, the more shaded it gets. See the shadow casting? Look at that. That is a whole lot of shadow. And right here, we got a pretty interesting one. We got the big one and the little one. You see the little one up here in front. You can see the shadow from the big one in the back. And as the sun comes up, it only goes to show that what I'm saying is true. There's light being blocked right here and more light being blocked all the way across. See how the light is going around this area and not illuminating that area? Look at all the flares. <laughs> see, that's a flare. <laughs> but you see how dark all this is? This is all still in the shadow. Now, with the sun coming off of the front of the lens, this should have brightened up, and as you saw, it did not. And let's look at it from the uh, sundown position as the sun's going to be going down way off to the left as you can see it's still staying pretty dark up here the light is finally getting below here hitting the clouds over here and illuminating the front of this but as you see this stayed in the dark the whole time it was shadowed the entire time see that planets in the sky alright let's have another look from a different camera as you can see, there's the, the two again. You can see where the light's bending around a couple other things over here. And I'm going to back it up a little bit. See the shadows? See how the light's bending around nothing <laughs> or something as the sun goes up I mean even over here it's still really dark the sun is up there things are illuminating and then again things are not and as the sun goes up past the you can see the great big circle over here of darkened area Again, great big area of darkened circle. Pushing the light, pinching it down and under, as you can see right there. This is not illuminating until the sun gets low enough to illuminate it. See how the light goes all the way around? Now it's illuminating, see? And again, this area right here, really dark over here, blocking light, big shadow up there, 
You can see the big shadow right here as well, off to the side. Now it's starting to illuminate the bottom of this. See how the light went all the way down and under that whole area of blue area? Of course you did. Now let's watch this one really fast. Can you see the shadows? Over here, over there. How the light's wrapping around things. Let's back up and look at it again. <laughs> see that shadow line right there? You also got the light stopping right here, basically. Great big shadow. These are our clouds down here below. This is everything that's beyond our sky. You can tell because it looks like it's going the wrong direction. And it's reflecting a lot of light. <laughs> All right, now here we have the same old, same old. Got a great big cast shadow. Every location, not just one, not two, not three, all of them. There's the color of it right there. See it? Now it's going to illuminate it really bright. See, there it goes. Really bright. See, There's something there. See how dark it is up here? Shadow casting. This is also going to be blocking light here shortly. But you can see how dark all that is staying behind there. As the sun gets lower, it'll start to illuminate. You can also see the light coming around the back side of whatever's right here. See how it gets real bright afterwards? <laughs> it's all dark during the day, and then when the sun goes down, it lights up. Imagine that. That says something's there. As you can see, the sun is being blocked in many different areas, not illuminating. Even when the sun is covered up by the clouds, it doesn't change. Lots of cast shadow. Look how green all that is. Ah. All right, we got two cast shadows right away. Now this is with the line that we that is pointing to where those two planets have a hole in them, you know, and that's where you're going to see the light coming out here shortly. In between them, boom, there it is, same spot. It's going around this planet right here. As you'll see, the sun is actually going to set over here somewhere. I know it looks like it's over here, but it's not. It's over here. See? Light on both sides. Casting shadow. Now it's going to illuminate. There it is. That one is illuminating too. The bigger one. And this is... See how all this lit up? See all of that's lit up a different color? Got the sun's light going all the way around it. But all of this is that really bright blue. See all that? Now, see how bright all that is? Now it's going to contain itself to this edge. Of brightness right in this area everything behind it will start to go into a shadow see there it is that's the shadow see the light is breaking around something I 
I mean, the sun is way off to the right. Look at the shadow it's casting across the sky. Now let's watch the sun go down from the same location. See this great big cast shadow over here? <laughs> yeah, the sun goes down way over there, actually. Way over here. And you can see the lights coming down right here. A lot of light. A lot of light. Here is what would appear to be a moon of some sort. Maybe. I don't know. I know this is at the bottom of something much bigger. But like I said, that was moving to the right, as we saw. And there goes the sun. So, yeah. <laughs> All right. Cabo San Lucas. See how this shadow is going right down the middle of this? It's got nothing to do with the uh, with the glare on the lens on the other side. See how dark all that is? See how the light's just staying right there? Going all the way down and under? Something's there. Very obvious. All right, let's have a look at Cabo from a different angle. See how the light's crescent illuminating the side of this right here? Now all of this is staying in the shadow. See, crescent illuminating again, big shadow. <laughs> now the light's going all the way down and under. And finally illuminating that for a very brief moment. But still, shadow. <laughs> Every single location shows the same thing. Regardless of what the clouds are doing. Alright, this is a sunrise. As you see the lights bending around something there. See how all this is staying in the dark over here. As the sun comes up, it'll illuminate for a short amount of time, and then it'll go dark again. See, you can you can almost see it, regardless of the clouds. Got the light coming out the back side of what's right here. See that? How it's bending around that area? Clouds are moving, but this is not. See how dark it stayed over here? Big old cast shadow. And there goes the sun, and see how this area has got light going all the way around it. And there goes the illumination of the bigger one above. And another location with something in the way. Here comes the sun from under, from behind that. Also see this and over here as well, blocking light. How cool is that? Anyway, hope everybody has a safe weekend. Y'all have fun. Please share. Have a great day.